squeaky friends welcome back to circle time today we are going to figure out what day of the week it is but before we do that let's sing all together and you know what even though we're not all together in the same room we might be watching this video all together at the same time so i think maybe we'll sing the more we get together are you ready the more we get together, 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 the more we get together, the happier we'll be. For your friends are my friends, and my friends are your friends. The more we get together, the happier we'll be. Good job, everybody. If you're watching with mom and dad, you might want to show them some of the, the signs that we do with our hands. Remember, when we say more, put your hands together like this. More. Happy. Put your hands right here. And move them up. Happy. Together. Give two thumbs up and put your hands together. Together. Friends is another one we like to say a lot. Friends, take one finger, bend it, take the other finger, friend. Kind of tap back and forth. Friend, my, your. When we talk about how happy we will be in the future, you move your hand forward like you're going into the future. And those are all the things we do with our hands, right? Show mom and dad, or maybe your brothers and sisters who are watching with you, and you guys can do it all together. Okay, friends, let's see what day of the week it is. Ready? Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday. And that makes the week in Espanol, por favor. Domingo, lunes, martes, miércoles, jueves, viernes, sábado. Good job, everyone. Now let's see what today is. Are you ready? Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday. Friday is a happy, happy day. It's a day for going to school. It's a day for going to school. Friday is a happy, happy day. Woohoo, everybody! It is Friday. Do you remember whose favorite day is Friday? Miss Cat. Miss Cat loves Friday. I wonder what she's doing on this Friday. Do you think she's with Mary Olive? Maybe they're singing songs together right now, too. Oh, I bet they are. Hi, Miss Cat. Everyone say hi, Miss Cat. You know who she'd like to say hi to? Miss Christina. Maybe she's watching at home right now, too. Everyone say hi, Miss Christina. Oh, you know what? I bet you guys, with all those hellos and waves, they felt that in their heart. Oh, what a good way to start a Friday. All right, so we need to figure out what day it is. We know the day is Friday. What is the date? Let's see what number it is. Can you all say 27 with me? This is the number 27. Let's say it together. 27. Good counting. We haven't counted yet, but good job saying 27. All right, you guys, should we count to 27? Should we do 27 times? I think because it's Friday and we are all so excited, let's clap to 27. Ready? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Almost there. 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. Keep going. 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27. Nice counting this time, everybody. Good clapping. I think I heard all of it. Maybe 
these are loud clappers, loud counters too. I love it. You know what? We haven't sung what month it is in a little bit. So let's sing our months of the year song. Are you ready? January, February, March, and April, May, June, July, and August, September, October, November, and December. These are the months of the year. Should we try to go really slow? January, February, March, and April, May, June, July, and August, September, October, November, and December. These are the months of the year. Woo! That was slow! Should we try to go really fast now? Ooh, I hope I can keep up. Let's see. Let's go. January, February, March, and April, May, June, July, and August, September, October, November, December. These are the months of the year. Woo! That was fast. Did you guys say them all? I don't even know if I said them all. I bet you guys got them all though. All right, so now let's keep moving with circle time. I think we should sing one of our favorites. We are gonna sing Shoe Fly. Let's go a little closer so that you can see the pictures. And remember, it's easier for me to look and read the words and then show you the pictures, okay? And for this one, I'm going to sing it. Shoe fly, don't bother me. Shoe fly, don't bother me. Shoe fly, don't bother me. I belong to somebody. I hope you guys are singing along too. That fly has gone away. At last I'm free to play. I told that pest to scram. Now I'm happy as a clam. Shoe fly, don't bother me. You're not my cup of tea. Please stop annoying me. Kindly go and let me be. I think I'll find a book. Curl up and read a book. Some nice and quiet spot, some place where that fly is not. Shoe fly, don't bother me. Go fly to Tennessee. Leave on the count of three. Can't you see you're bugging me? This shoe, silly fly, will not shoe. I need to go outside and find a place to hide. My plan had better work or I'll really go berserk. Do you guys remember what berserk is another word for? Crazy. It means you'll go crazy. You just can't take it anymore. Shoe fly, don't bother me. Please leave immediately. Fly far away from me. I don't want your company. My tummy has a hunch that it could use some lunch. I think the coast is clear. No more buzzing in my ear. Do you think the fly is really gone? Shoe fly, don't bother me. Go find your family. Go hide up in a tree. Just don't stay and pester me. Ooh, our little mouse friend is not happy. He's shooting the water out of the hose, trying to get the fly to go away. Oh, I really need a rest from that unwelcome guest. I better take a nap, otherwise I think I'll snap. Oh, poor little mouse. 
just needs a rest. Oh, shoe fly, don't bother me. Go spread your wings and flee across the great blue sea all the way to Waikiki. I'm beat without a doubt, that fly has worn me out, so now I'll close my eyes, hope that I don't dream of flies. Shoe fly don't bother me, shoe fly don't bother me, shoe fly don't bother me, I belong to somebody. All right, I haven't heard that song in a week or so. It was nice to sing that again. All right, you guys, let's play a game. Do you remember when we were still all together at school, we had just gotten this really fun dice. Remember, this game is called Roll and Play. We take our dice here, our cube, and we roll it, and we see what color lands on top. Whatever color, we pick a card. And that card tells us what to do. So we've got green, um, that tells us some animal sounds. Yellow, which is feelings for us to make. We have red, which tells us an action to do. We have orange, which I think also tells us um, something to do with our body. We have purple, which another activity and action and all the blue cards tell us to go find some colors so I'm gonna roll our dice and we're gonna see what color it tells us to pick a card from so ready <gasps> blue okay so I'm gonna pick a card that's blue and it says find something red so I want you to look around your house Wherever you are, maybe you're in your living room, maybe in your kitchen, and see if you can find something red. I'm gonna look around where I'm at, right here in circle, and see if I can find something red. Hmm, you know what I see? I see a red crayon. What did you find that was red? Let's see what color we'll roll next. Ready? Red! Let's see what our red card says. Our red card says to blow a kiss. I want everyone to blow a kiss. Mwah. All right, let's see what color we get next. Orange, let's see what our orange card says. Here's our orange card. It says hop four times. So I'm sitting down. I can't hop as well as you can at home, but I want you to stand up and hop four times. I'll have, hop right here on my knees. Ready? We're gonna count to four. All right, let's go. One, two, three, four. Good hops, you guys. All right, let's see what other colors we get. Yellow. Let's see what our yellow card tells us. Oh, this one says to make a sleepy face. Do you all make your <sighs> sleepiest face? <sighs> so sleepy. So sleepy. Right, let's see what color next. <gasps> green. Let's see what our green card says. It's telling us to neigh like a horse. Can you make a sound like a horse? Ready? Nay, nay, nay. Good job, you guys. All right, let's see what color we get next. Mm, purple. Let's see what the purple card says. It says to touch your elbow. Here's my elbow. And touching your elbow. Let's switch and touch our other elbow. Good. All right, let's see what color we get next. I think we've done one of every color. Let's see what we roll next. Red. Our 
red card says play patty cake. Have you ever played patty cake before? If not, get your mom or your dad or your sister or your brother and play patty cake with them. It goes like this. Put your hands and go patty cake, patty cake, baker's man. Bake me a cake as fast as you can. Roll it, pat it, Mark it with the, what should we mark it with? Mark it with your letter and mark it with an E, that's my letter, and put it in the oven for Emily and me. But you guys can say your name instead. Okay, try that at home with your friends, your mom, your dad, your sister, your brother, maybe grandma or grandpa. I bet they would love to play patty cake with you. Okay, let's see what color we get next. Orange. Our orange card tells us to blink our eyes three times. So when you blink, remember, it's when you close your eyes like this. That's a blink, okay? So let's blink three times. One, two, three. Good blinking. All right, let's see what we get next. Yellow, let's see what feeling it wants us to feel. Oh, it wants us to make a sad face. Can you all make a sad face? I don't wanna be sad though, so now everyone make a happy face. Oh, I like those happy faces so much better. Okay, let's see, let's roll one more and then we will read a story, okay? Let's see, last one. Oh, mm. blue. All right, let's see what our blue wants us to find. <gasps> our blue card wants you to find something purple. So look around your room and see if you can find anything purple. Hmm, I'm looking around me and seeing what I can find that is purple. <gasps> you know what I see that's purple? I'm gonna grab it really quick. bucket. That's purple. What did you find that was purple? All right. Good job, everyone. Maybe we'll play that game another day. I like that game because you get to do a lot of different things. You get to make faces. You get to find colors. You get to jump up and down or blink three times. I think that one's fun. Okay. Now we are going to read a story. We've been talking a lot about colors today and we've even done some feelings. And this book, The Color Monster, kind of combines both of those. It talks about colors and feelings. Remember right here, this is our friend, The Color Monster. Okay, again, I'm gonna read the words and then I'll, I'll show you the pictures. Oh, this is my friend, The Color Monster. Today he's feeling all mixed up but he doesn't understand why. Look at you. You're a mess, color monster. Does he look like he's all mixed up? Maybe he's feeling a lot of things. You've jumbled all your emotions and all of your colors too. Ooh, he looks pretty jumbled. I know. I can separate your feelings and put each one in its own jar. If you like, I can help you. So see, there's the jars. She's going to try and help him sort his feelings into each one. This is happiness. It shines yellow like the sun and twinkles like the stars. When you're happy, you laugh and jump and dance and play. You want to share that feeling with everyone. For yellow, that's our happy color, yellow. Oh, this is sadness. It's gentle and blue like a rainy day. When you're sad, you might want to cry or be alone. This is blue. It represents maybe when we're feeling sad. This is anger. 
It blazes bright red. When you're angry, you want to stomp and roar and shout. It's not fair. Oh, this is red and it represents anger. Can I see your angry face? This is fear. It hides in the black shadows. When you're afraid, you feel tiny and helpless. Fear makes it hard to be brave. Color black represents fear. Can I see a scared, fearful face? <gasps> this is calm. It is as light as a green leaf floating in the wind. When you're calm, you breathe slowly and deeply. You feel at peace. Let's breathe slowly together. Do you feel a little bit more calm? I think my body does. Green is the color of calm. All your feelings are in their places now. See, they're easier to understand when they're not all mixed together. Let's see. Do you guys remember what color sadness was? Blue. What about anger? What color was anger? Red. How about fear? Black. Do you remember calm? Green. How about happiness? Yellow. But wait, there's one feeling left over. What could it be? Do you guys remember what feeling was left over that was pink and had hearts all around it? Love! That's the best feeling of all, isn't it? And what a great feeling to leave with on our Friday circle. Friends, I have so much love in my heart and I hope you can feel it for all of you. I miss getting to see all of your faces, but I know in my heart that our love keeps us all together. It keeps you and your family together, you and your friends. We're all feeling the love and you can spread it by waving hello to people you see. You can blow them a kiss. There's lots of ways to show your love. All right, friends. I'll see you next time at Circle, and I hope you have a great rest of your day. Love you all. Bye.